This is a quick video on a home automation solution that involves the sewn off window and door sensor and the sewn off motion sensor, both Zigbee. So the problem that we had at my house was in our kitchen, we keep the ambience lighting at blue because I just like the blue color. I think it's relaxing and it looks cool. The problem with that is when we wanted to cook it's really hard to see what you're doing in here. You, you can't cook with the lights on blue. It's impossible to see. And so what we kept having to do was ask the person in the other room, whose name I can't say, to change the lights to white. So I wanted to automate that. So what I did was I took the uh, sewn off window and door sensor. I put it on the side of the stove, right? And I set up a routine and the person in the other room who I cannot name, that when I open the oven door, the lights change to bright white, All right? So now we can see to cook. <clears throat> part of the problem was now solved. The second part of the problem though was when we're done cooking, how do we get the lights to go back to blue, All right? So that's where the motion sensor comes into play. I just stuck it on the side of the uh, refrigerator facing this direction. I set up a routine in that person whose name I can't say that if there is no motion sensed for 15 minutes, all right, then we assume there's nobody in the kitchen. And at that point, the lights will change back to blue. So there you go. A quick uh, home automation solution that involves the sewn off window door sensor and the sewn off Zigbee motion sensor. Have a good day.